Well, I love to have the people on from our wonderful video club. I mean, if you don't know about it, it is a tremendous resource, not only for creativity, where you meet people, maybe learn how to make videos, but what we're gonna talk about today, you got some old stuff you wanna transfer to digital format, it is something that they can help with you. And it's fantastic. Um, uh, Pat Bettendorf is here today, along with Betsy Martin. Now, um, I want to introduce you because I don't know if you've been on before or I have if I've not. met you. I know I've met you before. I'm a, a new, relatively new resident. Uh, we moved here, well, we just bought a, a new condo this, this last summer. Great. So uh, I've been here for, for a couple years, but uh, now we're permanent. Or, you know, Where are there. you from? Well, we live, we, uh, we're in Glendale. Okay, because uh, I'm looking at your bio. You were with we, uh, CBS for I, years. Yes, I did work in uh, Hollywood. Television City? Yeah, or? No, well, I started out at Television City, but uh, primarily I worked at uh, Sunset and Gower. Okay. That was before they moved out to Studio City. Yeah. And because, uh, as a matter of fact, they moved out the year after I retired. So I, Sunset and Gower. All right, yeah, I know right where that is, right near to, um, Paramount. Right, uh, yeah. right and uh, right near the... Uh, that's the Palladium right across, yeah. from, across from there. Right? Yeah, I think right around there, what's it called, Radcliffe? Or, I know Desi, Desi Lou used to be right in that area. Oh, yes. Yeah. Uh -huh. yeah, great to have you here. And your background, a videotape librarian. and Okay, this is something that really goes back, and I want you to explain this. Sorry, Betsy. No, no, oh. please. <laughs> but um, I know what this is, and, but a lot of people probably don't. A telecine operator. Telecine. That, yeah. was, that was my first technical mm -hmm. job at CBS is I, I operated a, it was a movie camera mm -hmm. or a movie projector <clears throat> yeah. that transferred directly into television signals. So every night, and it was an overnight thing because all of our movies yeah, were, yeah. were played overnight and uh, it, I would have to thread, the, it was just a regular projector, mm -hmm. well, somewhat regular, yeah. and uh, the old 16 millimeter and 35 millimeter film and we transferred them it to, we didn't actually transfer it. It played directly yeah. into a television camera. Mm -hmm. That's right, yeah. And, and went on directly on the air. Yeah. And, uh, I spent many nights uh, with broken film. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> and I bet. They would have to go to commercial, and I would have to get off and splice it <laughs> and put them back up. It was quite a quite an interesting job, I'll tell you. But I was all alone, except for the techn technical director in the control room. Yeah. That, that is a, fantastic. Yeah, that was, uh, it's kind of like years and years, years ago. Years, many, many years on ago. On the news, about they would say film at 11 because they really used film, and they had to transfer it very quickly, or, or they used that kind of system to, uh -huh. to broadcast it. Yeah, that was... Yeah, interesting. Those are old days. <laughs> yes, <laughs> those, yeah. Those machines were pulled out probably 30, 35 years ago. Yeah, so. wow. Now, uh, Betsy, we're, as I said, we're going to be uh, mainly talking about um, the transfers that you folks do, and we're going to get into that in just a minute and show a little video. But first, just you know, give us an overview of the Video Club if people don't know what you're all about. <clears throat> we are located between Clubhouse 2 and the pool. We have a video lab where we have all the equipment to transfer all kinds of old uh, formats um, like this Super 8. That is, a, that is a regular eight. No, regular but eight. But we do have Super 8 also. Yes. Yes. And probably a lot of you have the uh, VHS yeah. <laughs> big old tapes that you can convert to uh, digital. You could put it on a flash drive or um, a CD. And we teach classes. Yes, you do. Um, and we're very excited about our new, our new schedule of classes this spring. You can learn to edit the stuff you transfer or the stuff you already have. Mm -hmm. uh, we have, uh, I think, about six PCs, three Macs, where uh, you can learn iMovie on one or uh, Corel mm -hmm. on the other. Also, uh, iMovie. Uh, is, it, is it called iMovie on, um, on the Sony? On the Mac. Uh, iMovie yeah. on, the, on, the on, the, on the Mac. Um, we're very excited about the classes we offer, and we teach you how to do it. Yeah. Uh, we'll assist you to get started, and as long as it takes you to learn it, we'll teach you. So that's, the, that's one of the reasons we, yeah. we, we are very excited about it. We teach you, and it's free. Yeah, and you know, um, nowadays, what are people using? They're using their phones, but it's still, 
capturing uh, video just in a digital medium. And I know Scott Marvel teaches a class on that. And uh, so those are all different classes you have. Now, we're going to show uh, this quick video here. And I think this is the Capture Center. Am I right? Uh, exactly. OK. Let's take a look at this, and then we'll be right back. This is the Video Club's capture area. We can take you know, the big VHS tapes and turn them into DVDs. Great for all your old stuff. Uh, we have a computer that will take records and cassettes, turn them into DVDs. We can copy seven of your DVDs at one time. We can make labels, send them to your relatives. It's a great place to have, preserve your memories. So there we are. You noticed that we have a machine that will make seven copies yeah. mm -hmm. of your videos to send to family. And we have a label maker. We'll show you how to use it. You can put a nice colorful uh, label with a picture of whatever, your family, you, uh, your wedding picture. Uh, also, you can take your slides and convert them. Yeah, that's digital. really helpful. And yeah. same with... Um, just paper photos. However, we do recommend you go to the PC yeah. lab. They've got a, a machine where you can put your your pictures yeah. in and just jim 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 very quickly yeah. to convert them to digital. Now, are you finding? Um, I mean, I know we certainly are, uh, but in general, people may not even want DVDs anymore. They just want the ability to upload it to YouTube, call their friends and family, or send them a link, and boom, it's done. We have been teaching a <clears throat> class on, on YouTube yep. on how to do that. See how I dovetail right Oh, that, that was great. <laughs> However, yes. our YouTube teacher has retired, and so we're looking for someone who really? will, will teach Who was that. your YouTube? I forget. Uh, Chuck Hale. Oh, that's right, Chuck, yes. And so he's gone cruises, and he's gone. That, I, I remember last time he was in, he was t telling me all the cruises they go on. Okay. Yeah. <clears throat> So uh, we got some things here. I love okay. show and tells. Show and, tell. we, and you showed um, Standard 8 versus Super 8. This so is, that really goes eight. back. It does. This, was, uh, this is actually from 1950. And you know and what? My, my, uh, my aunt. This is fantastic. You know what struck me on this? Because I certainly remember Super 8 as what my dad had. But it was even by then, it was plastic reels. And this is a metal reel. This is the, this is directly from. This Cold. is fantastic. They would send in the. They would send, yeah. it, send it to you this way, and they would mail it back to you because there yeah. was no labs in your neighborhood. Yeah, that is so cool. Yeah. <laughs> wow, but you guys can transfer film. We can transfer this, right? Which and, is huge and, because and there's so many people here. We transfer it directly here. to an SD card. <clears throat> okay. And then the SD card plugs into mm. your computer. Right. Yeah. yeah. So that's a great way to have it. And, and you can and. Just, then you can throw this away. <laughs> you can throw it away, yes, or, or save it for posterity. And it's I don't free. Know. It's, it's free. free. We would do it for free. It's free. Exactly. Uh, we need the guy from uh, Sit and Sleep to say that, right? <laughs> it's free. Now, yeah. I was, uh, of course, you got, um, when I got into, uh, you know, home having a video recorder and all that, my choice was always beta because I always felt it was better, uh, better quality. Uh -huh. And, of course, beta kind of lost out because... As you were saying, Pat, they didn't license it for other people to use. Right. And so was it JVC who first came out with VHS? I thought it was Panasonic. Okay. But, but they I, licensed it. Yeah, they did. They, anybody could <clears throat> make the right. machines. Right. And there was a difference. But you folks do both beta and... We uh, do. This, and this happens to be, uh, I got a camera. This was my daughter's tea dance when she, when she was seven years old. Wow. <laughs> Put it on here. <clears throat> and uh, then I, I got a new... Recorder. Mm -hmm. uh, about got DV the, here. This is a little DV. Yeah, tape, a little DV cam. And we and, can transfer uh, those also. That was yes. something from my. We still somewhat use this because uh, uh, the city still oh, the city is on okay. the system. Well, we have the ability to transfer those yeah. onto the computer, mm -hmm. and we can do uh, audio Cassette. tapes. Yeah. We have uh, regular <clears throat> audio cassettes, and uh, from what I'm not certain if we have a reel to reel. Tape machine. No, we, we do not. Don't, we, we have the ability, okay. but I don't know, because all we have to do is, I think uh, Lucy <coughs> says that she's going to bring in a that re, would be a real a real to real. Because oh, years right. ago, that's what people oh, used sure. it. So we, we were high-end recordings. This is Video 8. If you folks don't know about this, this was short, sort of short-lived. Uh, Sony brought this out, I want to say in the mid-80s. Could be. Yes, yes mid-80s. Right. Right. And I remember um, my Sony beta system was just going out. 
Oh, yeah. uh, it wasn't recording very well anymore. And I walked into, and I want to say it was Fedco, if you remember those markets. Oh, yeah. Uh -huh. uh, that had a lot of video stuff. It was incredible how much <laughs> they had there. And they had this new system. And I thought, this is good. It's compact and all that. It was great. And Sony never great. really, it was out for like maybe two, three years. And, and the quality was yeah. so good. <clears throat> And Sony just kind of let it go and got out of almost bad. the home video market. And that's yeah. why there's so much more of the VHS. Yeah. <laughs> Probably our most popular transfer machines, yes. we have three, is from the VHS to digital. And yeah, you oh, can, I'm sure, yes. And then uh, transfer it to a flash drive, go into our computers, we'll show you how to do that. And uh, it's just a wonderful learning opportunity. Uh, quick question for you. Do you do the European system? Do you, can you do PAL if somebody came from Europe and, and has these? Uh, do you have the, the ability to do PAL? I'm not I'm sure. Not Which sure. is a different standard, by the way, than, than what we have I, here. It's a different I, I would rate. think so, but I'm not absolutely okay. sure. But I we, wish I could answer that. when we can't do something, we have a professional, okay. Mike Bajic, and we'll send people there. He'll come to the village, pick up your, okay. your material, and he'll, he'll do a great job. Yeah. And he's very reasonable. Yeah. Well, this is fantastic. I mean, really, this was fun to see. Yeah. That's, and that, yeah. and, and uh, if, if they don't want to uh, stay in and do it, we will actually let them take the machine home over the weekend. Really? Yes, it's a wow. small machine. I should have brought it in. It, was, it's, it, it would fit right here on the table. And uh, they could take it home and transfer them. It, oh, it, is this it right it's here? right behind us, yes. Yeah. Oh, look at that. <laughs> they had the slide. That is fantastic. Right. And it, wow. it, it works great. Look at that. <laughs> That's how it goes. <laughs> it, does it, it, it does it by the, it, it, um, kind of like a image by image like this? Right, or that it's one frame down? at a time, so it takes a while. Yeah. It's a lot longer than, it'll, it'll take you an hour and a half to do, a, I don't know, a 30, 30, a minute maybe? Yeah, okay. So it takes quite a That's while. That's good to know. But, and so you could take the machine home. I think we uh, they leave a, a yeah. check for a deposit. But, right. Uh, but it's, uh, it's free. And, uh well, folks, uh, thank you for coming on. Thank you. I think it's fantastic. Appreciate Betsy, it. always good to see you. Nice to meet you, Pat. Good. You too. And folks, Appreciate the Video it. Club, again, is located adjacent to Clubhouse 2 over by between that and the pool. And uh, just go by there and see where what's going on. And we're open <clears throat> Tuesday through Fridays, 1 to 4 p.m. Okay. And there's always one or two supervisors there to help. Yeah, I always say, you know, if you're... Go by once, even if at that time you're, you don't have anything you want to transfer or whatever, because then it sticks to your memory. So when you're ready, you're like, ah, I know exactly where to go. Yes. Yep, and learn, so. learn some video. Bring your phone in. They'll help you out. We'll help you out, yeah. and it's all free. Yeah, thank you very much. <laughs> okay. I really appreciate seeing you folks, and uh, we'll be right back.